Hey there, people. This is D from Tech Shop 82. Just doing a very quick video on how to update your um, TS95 boxes that you bought from my site. And this video, I'll show you how to connect to the T95 uh, via SSH on. Right now, I'm on a Windows PC and I have the terminal or command prompt window open. You can do this from any um, command prompt session. If you're on a Mac, you can open up a program called Terminal and it'll, it'll, it'll be the exact same commands that you enter. So I need to first connect to the box. So on my network, I have typically you would do SSH root at escape pod dot local. Now, this would work. You wouldn't see this warning that you've seen, but I, on in my network, I have I have a lot of escape pods that local. So what you can do then is, if you know the IP address of your box, you can SSH directly to that. So it would be SSH. In my case, it's one nine two one six eight zero dot two zero six. In your case, you need to know what the IP address is for your box. And, or you can just do SSH root at escape pod dot local because there's a high chance you only have one escape pod dot local running in your network. You hit enter and then you'll be presented with this. Hey, I don't know what this box is. Do you want to connect? Just go ahead and type yes and hit enter. Then it's going to ask you for the password. Now the password is wire pod. All lowercase, you don't need to... There's no space, there's no dash, it's just wire pod. And when you type, um, the text is hidden, so you won't see anything on the screen. So I'll go ahead and type wire pod and hit enter. And then when you get logged in, you'll be presented with a splash screen that if you connected the box to an HDMI output that you see. So right now, I'm on the box. And then, right now is where you would paste or type in the update command that I had uh, written. So, and I'll put this in the video so you can just copy it from there. But it is, the command is WGET space dash uppercase O space dash space. And then this is the URL. Let me go get it. The URL to the update script. So I'm just going to paste that there, space, and then a pipe, which is the, well, depending on which keyboard, it's the key above your enter key. So if you have the USA keyboard layout, it's the key above the enter key. So shift that key will give you the pipe. And then I am going to type bash, B-A-S-H. So what this does is the update script, I need to execute it on the, on my uh, T95. So the we get goes and gets it and it says, okay, bash, I need you to run this script. So that's what this command does. And then I hit, uh, then you go ahead and just hit enter. So what this does, it downloads the script and then it executes the commands that are in there. Now I've already updated this one. It might do another update. I'm not sure if wire has released anything. But this is how you update your T95. You just SSH to the box and then paste or run that command. And then it'll take a while because it has to download files and check for updates. And typically runtime will be like two, two to five minutes. And then at the end, it will say all done at the end. If you get an error during this process, that means something has gone wrong. You can go ahead and try it again. Um, you shouldn't get an error, but if you do, um, you can P PM me and then just let me know. So we'll just watch this and we'll see if this finishes. So right now it's, it's updating the Wirepods, uh, service, right, right? You can see that here It's building the chipper server. It's gone into the Wirepod, uh, directory and run the update script. So there was an update 
and that's what this is. So it says head is now at this up this um, version. So it's updating. Uh, this part takes a minute, and then once this is done, it's then going to um, download all the plugins that I have created and update those as well. So that's what the greetings plugins I created. The Simon Says plugin that a lot of people don't know it's on their box, but it's there. If you do say, hey, Vector, Simon Says, blah, blah, blah. Vector will repeat whatever you say after Simon Says. And then the date one, and then it says all done. And so once you, once you see this all done, then it is, you're all done. You can just hit exit to exit out of the connection and now you're back in your terminal and that is how you update your T95s um, in the wild. All right, if you have any questions, uh, shoot me an email, let me know and I will catch you guys in the next one.